This is the factory Pringles that has zero grams. It has this many squares. This is the Lay's baked. And it came. And it's a little This is the. This is the pork rinds, and it had 624 squares covered with grease. This is the muncho potato chips, and this this had 823 squares filled with grease. This one with the most grams of fat is it's 11 grams, and it's the better made original, and it has 749 squares filled with grease. As you can see. There's the more grams they have, they go up in grease. And uh, like it's a board. There, there's two grams to show you. As you can see. And she can take a cup from oh, oh, the proceeded what we did was the circle science fair project. Lay a piece of grass graph paper down on the table. Open the first one. two. Open the first bag of potato chips and lay a handful on the scale. Weigh the potato chips. Record the weight in your lab notebook. You will want one ounce of potato chips, so either add or remove some of, some if your handful of chips isn't within that range. Three. Now take the potato chips and place them in the middle of your graph paper. Place, place a clean Place a piece of clean wax paper on top of the chips. Four. Carefully press down on the wax paper and crush the potato chips. Use a rolling pin to crush the chips into small pieces. Five. Let the potato chips sit in the paper for one minute. After one minute has passed, put the wax paper in the and the potato chips into the trash. Tape the paper to a well-lit window so that you can see the stain clearly. Six. Repeat the steps one through five for the other varieties of potato chips. Be sure that you use the same weight of potato chips for all the, for all the varieties. Also use new graph paper and fresh wax paper on the top of the graph, on the top of the potato chips. Let the stains hang on the window for ten more minutes. Squares are coming you. You, should also record, you should also count squares that are only partially stained. Record your observations about the size of, of the grease stains in your lab notebook. And the title of, of my science project was How Greasy Are Your Potato Chips? Or How Greasy Are Your Chips? Alright, cool. Good job. That's it.